Hello, my name is Eileen Brook Freeman, and this short film will introduce you to the Think Project Tourism and Marketing Strategy. The Think Partnership produced a branding and marketing strategy to help raise the status and awareness of Think sites, both collectively and individually, and to develop joint marketing techniques and products, both to increase visitor numbers and manage them in a sustainable way. In marketing our sites, we faced a number of challenges. One was the huge difference in scale. Some were well developed with a good infrastructure in place. Others, such as those in Orkney, were virtually unknown with no on-site interpretation or facilities. Some sites aimed to attract visitors, whilst others, like Thingvella in Iceland, would perhaps prefer to limit visitor numbers or redirect some of them as the existing infrastructure struggled to cope with the sheer volume of daily visitors. There were also different requirements and priorities within different countries, different areas and different cultures. This meant that a range of promotional techniques were developed which could be adapted to best suit individual needs. I'd now like to tell you more about some of these and show you some examples. We started by developing a logo for the Thing project which could help link the historic sites and the Link Thing Sites logo, which was more appropriate for marketing sites and could be used to widen the network in the future. Branded marketing tools included business cards, flash drives, stickers and t-shirts, advertising the tourism website www.thingsites.com with flash drives loaded with text and images to share knowledge about Thing Sites and the project with business and tourism partners local school children and heritage groups and potential future collaborators and the wider public. To share knowledge, disseminate information and market sites, we developed websites with linked digital media and social networking and printed and online promotional leaflets, articles and books, as well as activities aimed at a range of target groups from school children and the local population to tourists and universities and colleges. In developing sustainable site management guidelines, we analysed the status of individual sites in relation to the local infrastructure and visitor facilities and exchanged experiences. We identified and worked with local and regional tourist organisations and other business partners to market sites and develop further activities. Various sustainable events were developed and marketed at sites. Examples include a Thing Play performed on site at Thingwell in Shetland, which was also filmed to provide a lasting educational resource, and an archaeological excavation and conference at Thingwell in Highland Scotland, where local history group members worked closely with archaeologists and shared knowledge about the local site and the project with a wide audience representing councillors and officials, local businesses, tourism agencies, schools and heritage groups and other project partners. Filming this event increased the reach to the wider partnership. We developed a range of interpretive material and activities aimed at varying target groups. These included interviews and articles in a range of media and a Viking day at a Thing site for primary school children in Orkney, where they learned about life in the Viking era and what happened at a Thing through role play and trying out Viking crafts and games. In considering theme tours, we joined representatives of Smiddle Line on a Viking cruise between the Faroe Islands, Shetland and Orkney to discuss future opportunities. And for our themed historical tour, we developed a geo tour to link the Thing sites in a sustainable fashion through encouraging tourists and local adventurers to track down geocaches hidden throughout the partner regions. The Thing Project Tourism and Marketing Strategy is available through our service model at www.thingproject.eu where you can also find detailed case studies explaining what we did and including details of particular challenges faced. The strategy has been an important internal product for partners and it also provides a good framework for other Thing sites or similar heritage sites looking to enhance their profile, share knowledge and market their sites.